back now on Ice Town TV and I'm delighted to be joined by Cardiff Devils head coach Andrew Lord and uh, Andrew a very tough 48 hours uh, two very different wins but a lot of character shown by your team yeah I think it was uh, it was huge uh, usually like to go one game at a time but uh, I was definitely aware of this little uh, wrinkle in the schedule of Thursday Friday uh, a real tough back-to-back -back going up north and coming back down and um, I mean we just found a way plain and simple we found a way um, last night I didn't think we were all that sharp um, <clears throat> at times and a uh, very difficult place to play at Fife they played hard um, you know to go down 2-1 early in the third uh, made it tough on us but uh, the character show there to, to claw it out was phenomenal uh, and then tonight uh, you know to play a you know if you could pick a team to play when you know, you played the night before and they haven't. I think Guilford's probably the last team you'd pick. You know, a quick, uh, water bug-like like team. And you could see their speed there, especially in the first. It took us a little uh, of time to get adjusted to it. Much faster paced game than last night. And then um, I thought as the game went along, we got better and better. I thought the first goal was huge. And, uh, you know, we're defending really well right now. Um, Bounds, had a good night. But at the same time, I thought to a man, Huge buy-in here, um, and yeah, a couple, couple great wins. One man who's been instrumental in both of those wins, Lane Ulmer, uh, coming up with a game-tying goal last night in the third period and getting that all-important go-ahead goal uh, tonight. Just how lucky are you to have a man like Lane Ulmer going down the stretch? Yeah, he's huge. He's uh, one of the smarter players I've uh, been around, for sure, in pro hockey. Reads the game great, um, you know, just find spots all over the ice particularly in the offensive zone obviously is a quick release and uh, he reads goalies very well um, in addition to everything else and you know last night's goal was huge he, he beat a guy one-on-one -on -one, which isn't you know really his game and he puts it up upstairs and it was big you know we were um, we, we were not all that great um, we we're struggling a little bit that was a huge goal for us tonight same thing I think the first one was big uh, to get a lead and um, you know Great guy, real heartbeat of the team. He uh, cares so much. Great guy, um, you know, real funny, energetic guy. Um, kind of an old school hockey player, and you know, personally, I've I've loved having him around. He just uh, brings a good laugh to the room, and uh, yeah, as far as uh, a big game player, I'm not sure you're going to find anyone better than that, than Lane Almer. Seven biggest games of the year <laughs> still to go uh, for your team. Uh, as you personally, as a coach, is is this what gets you really excited? You got these seven games coming up. Sheffield away up next. You got a couple of days off um, now over this weekend. Are you going to take a little bit of stock? Are you going to get the guys in over this weekend? How are you going to manage the this uh, race Saturday and Sunday without action? Yeah, it's huge. It's uh, I mean, it's where you want to be. Um, you know, I just feel really fortunate for five years in a row now. We've been right in the title race. It's so much fun. I think, I think we all sort of take it for granted at this point, but uh, it's hard. It's really hard to be where we're at. We're in a great spot. That's all uh, all it is right now, though. Still plenty of hockey to be played. Uh, we really do need to get rested here. We need to get healthy. Uh, and we need to be smart over the next few days here, absolutely. I think we also uh, have a chance to, you know, a nice balance. Get away from the game a little bit, have some laughs. Also uh, get on the mend and uh, have a big week next week. And, um, you know, it doesn't get any easier. But uh, really, really enjoying, uh, you know, challenging myself and, uh, you know, just being part of this, it, it's tough. The, the league's so much better. I know I'm on repeat saying that every every interview, <laughs> but it really is, uh, and it takes a lot to, to claw out these wins like we're doing right now. Really proud of the guys, and uh, yeah, it's uh, it's fun to be part of this organization right now.